All right, this is just a quick um, video to cover how we can handle um, the recent uh, examples in a Jupyter notebook. Um, I'm also going to show how to handle these arguments in a um, text editor as well. The idea is, is that, you know, out of the box, it doesn't work in a Jupyter notebook quite the same because this function is really a command line argument function. So um, a lot of these examples were only are only accessible from using a command line or something similar to a command line. Um, all right, so what I have is actually, I in Jupyter you can um, open a new text file and you see that it creates a new text file here. What I've done is just done, the, I created a new text file, but I put the contents of that um, exercise in that file and then I renamed it as x13.py. So if I come back to my notebook here, um, recognize that that file is in the same location as this notebook and I can see it in running a command line prompts in, in the notebook you can do some many of them with an exclamation point so if I list um, I'm sorry um, <clears throat> what I want to do is I want to actually uh, run that Python um, x13.py and then, um, just like the exercises show, I need to enter, uh, this is the script argument, but I need a first, second, and third. So I can just say like one, uh, two, three or something. And that executes that Python script, okay? Um, and that's how I can use it in a Jupyter notebook. But you do have to save a separate file and call that file um, in a notebook cell like I did here. Okay, and then the next exercises are just changing kind of what we uh, what we call here. So if I say instead, um, you know, uh, dog, cat, baby, right? It just changes what I have in my uh, script. It looks like I've duplicated that third uh, print statement, but that's fine. Can just change that yeah oh yeah I used an F string instead okay Save that. all right and then in a text editor um, similar idea that I, I have uh, a file called x13 right that's a dot pi file same contents um, but then I come into my, I have a terminal roll, running here. Um, and let me see if I, yeah. So I'll execute the same command. I'll say Python uh, x13. And then I'll say, you know, one, two, three. And there we go. Same idea. Okay. So then I can just change those arguments and I'll see a different output in my terminal. Um, okay, so that's it.